Hello everyone, it's been a long time. I'm so happy to speak to you all again. Hey guys, I traveled to Nigeria last year, November. I was there until February ending. I'm so glad to be making this video. So while I was in Nigeria, I discovered this woman. She calls herself Wai Chusin. That means Chusin's woman, Akarasela. Hey, she makes one of the best Akara I have ever eaten in Ago Palace Way. So anytime I come here, she makes fresh Akara. When I mean fresh Akara, she makes the butter, scoop it in the oil and give it to me hot, hot as it should be. So here we are. She has blended her beans. This is white beans. It has been washed, blended, and now she's trying to mix them the beans and incorporate a one or two ingredients into it before scooping it into a preheated oil so for those of you who don't know what akara means akara means beans cake and it is made from beans and here she used white beans we have white beans we have brown beans we have different kind of beans but here she used um a white beans so now she's mixing she's adding water this is um water from the akara so when they blended the beans, they washed the like they wash off the remaining remaining parts of the of the beans from the machine with this water. So they reserve it in one side to avoid the akara butter from being too watery. If it is too watery, it is bad because you won't get that desired ball, those shapes that you that you want. So it's better to always blend your uh, akara very thick and they reserve. The water used in blending separately you can incorporate it bit by bit so she's adding extra water because she feels that the butter is too thick when it's too thick also they don't make a lot of gain <laughs> so now she's stirring mix she's mixing it and incorporating the water into the butter to give it a a lighter consistency So one thing I discovered is Akara is now more expensive than before. If I can say expensive anyway, it's not expensive. But the price of Akara is something else. One is sold for 15 era. So here she added the um, pepper mist. This pepper mist consists of scotch bonnet pepper. It's not much, it's very mild. And a lot of onion and a bit of um, red pepper called tatashe. So she added this and now she's adding salt for taste. So now she's mixing and combining the, the in what she added together to give it um, a good mix. So like I was saying before, Akara is now sold for 50 Naira. Back in the days, 10, 15 years ago, while I was, I was living in Nigeria, Akara is sold for 10 Naira, 20 Naira. And places where it's sold for 15 Naira, it has to be a big ball of Akara. So here is the preheated oil and she added red ball onion to it. This will release all the, all the flavor from the onion into the oil and it will give the Akara a good taste. Now she's scooping in the Akara butter into smaller portions into the oil you can use any shape of your choice you can use bigger spoon you can use small spoon but these people are making games so they have to use this size so this size of akara you are seeing is sold for 15 naira oh my god things have changed in nigeria so here she is scooping everything in there the pan is a bit jam packed but it's sizable enough the pan is sizable enough and she's frying with a, a gas cooker, which is making the bean, which cooks quite fast and makes the uh, akara ready in a couple of minutes. So like I was saying, back in the days, akara is sold for 10 naira, 20 naira. And when you go to like a place like a saba, where they sell 15 naira akara back in the days, they are quite big balls. Like three of these balls will make it one, will make one akara. You sold 15 right then when you eat it you know you have eaten one that is we call it one is one back in the days <laughs> yeah so the car is golden brown now she's turning she, she turned to the other side for the other parts to cook i think she will flip it again to give it uh to make it drier than it is because i told her 
I like my Akara dry. A bit crispy on the outside and very soft on the inside. So she flipped it again and trying to achieve that um, a bit of a dry uh, surface. So like I was saying, <laughs> Akara is expensive now if I'm to say. Just like every other thing in Nigeria. Akara is almost ready. Look at how shiny they are. As she's scooping out those Akara, I'm shining my eye and looking for the best bread to pick. I'm buying a thousand naira Akara and two bread because I have some bread at home. So we know it is better to, to combine this fresh Akara with fresh Agege bread. <laughs> and she have a couple of them in front of her. I am patiently waiting for my turn, which is now. So I handed over 8,500 to her and she will give me change. I am home. I am enjoying my soft akara with soft agege bread. It tastes so yummy. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. Drop a like button for me. Leave a comment if you're a fan of akara. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.